Hey guys, so in today's video I wanted to be doing like a little thing I struggled with. It was how to be emo when you don't have a hot topic in your country because I don't and that really sucks because a hot topic is amazing and you always see like those people like oh my god hot topic I just stop have hot topic all those band merch I'm like I don't have band merch and that was me like two three years ago maybe so uh, I'm today I'm going to be showing you how to be emo without hot topic so first things I did because this is like me but three years ago like I was always wearing black and stuff like oh my god I'm still alternative like I wanted to be emo but I didn't have I didn't know what to do so later I was like wait there is you can shop online so I just this so tip number what um, you know the little thingy you most of you have where you're watching YouTube on you can buy stuff online on that so that's one of the biggest things you should really reconsider doing because it works and you get tons of merch from all over the world but um, just try to search for stuff from your country because then you get the stuff a lot sooner and you can always shop on Hot Topic and just send it your way. So, Step number two. This is not only if you don't have a topic, but this is just for all emos. Like, Hot Topic is not that expensive, but it is a little like the, the jeans and stuff. I've seen it. I'm like, no, and then I'm not gonna um, pay that much for jeans. And if I say like mainstream stores like um, Primark and stuff like that and everyone's like oh my god no stop but you can like panties you can buy them at uh, Primark but you can buy black jeans and black black you know so that's one thing you should consider not only if you don't have a topic but also yeah if you don't have that much money and you want black jeans like and you can buy them ripped you can buy them normal you can buy other colors I don't own any of them and because they're cheap you can um, buy new ones if they're faded so that's nice here what are you doing so yeah you shouldn't be afraid for like um, mainstream um, stores because black jeans are black jeans you know so that's it and last but not least try to um, yeah visit like try to visit like festivals uh, for alternative people like you can always buy cool stuff there so that's I've never really seen like panties there but you can buy other alternative stuff one thing you should like consider is um, you can wear like anything and still be alternative like I can wear I have a lot of stuff and Mainly because I don't grow anymore, so I can hold everything. That's so amazing, I love that. I'm just so tiny, but it's so handy, yay. But I have um, like this little um, pink cloak, and it's weird as fuck, but I love it. And I know it's it's like really a baby pink, like something like this pink. It's like gun, cotton candy pink. I love it big though. Amazing. Like that pink and um, if I wear it I'm it doesn't feel like I'm still emo because I am I I'm I won't change. But yeah, don't don't be afraid to try on new things because if you like it why don't buy it? Like I don't like any that so I bought it and I'm wearing it and stuff you should consider is like if you wearing stuff doesn't feel alternative or doesn't feel um, that does feel mainstream. I like to add like uh, stuff that is totally opposite of that. So like like lips or studded demonia or something. Oh. Oh mm. It's just so cute. So yeah, stuff like that. And it turns your your um, whole outfit into uh, alternative. So that's another thing you should consider like the makeup and shoes that that would be uh, step number tip number four 
um, makeup and shoes and accessories in general that can turn your outfit into great stuff. So yeah, this was a little video about um, how to be emo without hard topic. I hope you liked it. Hope it yeah, it helped a little.